168. Why go back down when you still have an opportunity to dominate 175? Because I want to be that dominant fighter that dominates both weight classes. You know, I think it, it, it sends a stronger message if I could go down to 168, dominate that weight class, win a world, another world championship, and then come up to 168 and defend both of them simultaneously. You know what I mean? I think that's, that's, that's the mark of a Hall of Famer. You know what I mean? And that's, that's my main goal. You know, I want to be a Hall of Famer. I want to be remembered in the history books. And if that's going to get me there faster, then that's what I'm going to do. Adriana Noriega with ABN Sports and Fox Sports. It's over here, David, to your right. Congratulations, first of all, great performance tonight. You speak about dominating both uh, divisions. Here at 175, being your debut tonight, do you feel that once we have a winner between be bold and better be, is that the fight that you would want next at 175, or do you still think that you would want to do another one before it? Fight it's, not, it's, it's not the fight I want to win, it's just the fight I earned. When you win the, WB, the WBC interim title, you're entitled to the number one spot. So, like I said, I mean, these challenges are hard, but to become a great fighter, to become a legend, nobody's had it easy. None of the legends have had it easy, so why do I expect me to have it easy? You know what I mean? So, I just want to keep working hard, and I just want to thank my father, Jose Benavides, Samson Lukowitz, David Garcia, Luis de Cubas, Al Heyman. We're just going to keep going up. Thank you guys so much for everything. I appreciate you.